A bigger display, sharper cameras, and lower bezels are just a sum of the enhancements that the Galaxy S24 Ultra will provide. In addition, the phone's frame will be made of titanium rather than the aluminum used in current Ultra phones. Titanium is a premium material that is also much stronger than both aluminum and stainless steel. This is its biggest advantage. However, it has the disadvantage of being heavier than aluminum. Therefore, when we learned that Samsung was using this material on the S24 Ultra, many people expressed worry that this may make the phone hefty, which might have an impact on how usable it is for long periods of time. Surprisingly, however, that doesn't seem to be the case. The S24 Ultra will actually weigh less than the S23 Ultra even with a titanium frame. Although Ice Universe, the most frequent leaker of Samsung information, said that, it doesn't make logic. The S24 Ultra will actually weigh 1 gram less than the S23 Ultra, which is very amazing considering that titanium is both denser and more durable than aluminum. It would be fascinating to find out how precisely they accomplished this achievement. As you can see below, Samsung will enhance the camera UI for the S24 Ultra and add a second 5x button. They are acting in this way since the new 50 megapixels telephoto camera not only significantly enhances the 3x zoom but also the 5x zoom. The competition already has a telephoto camera with a greater megapixel count, and Samsung's intermediate zoom, particularly between the 5x and 7x zoom, has been a key shortcoming. Thus, the issue could be ultimately addressed by this new sensor. Moving on, a few weeks ago, we learned that Samsung's S24 Ultra could provide 65W of rapid charging. The absence of 65W of fast charging on the phone is confirmed by Ice Universe. Similar to the S23 Ultra, it will still have a 5000 mAh battery and operate at 45W. The primary reason why Samsung and other large corporations like Apple and Google don't want to provide high charging rates is that it causes the battery to deteriorate more quickly. To address the issue, several Chinese enterprises are employing twin battery configurations. Finally, what are your thoughts about it? So with that been said let me know your thought in the comment below and if you are new here please subscribe peace out.